What's up guys, it is your boy DJ Rick Webb and today I got a big collab vlog slash DJ vlog. So as you guys know, in the last gig log, DJ J Book drove all the way up from South Carolina to be here for the first ever school dance here in North Carolina for Fusion Sound and Lighting. Turned out pretty well, we had great reviews from that dance. Anyways, to return the favor, it is the Friday after that dance, I'm heading down to South Carolina where he's going to be DJing a sorority party. If you can't tell, I'm hyped for a college crowd, and especially a bunch of college sorority girls. But anyways, got the Jetpack custom bag right here all loaded up. As you guys know, this bag comes everywhere with me because it has literally everything. It has my phone charger, it has, my life is in this bag. So that's why I'm bringing it and the camera's going all over the plate. But anyways, Let's get on the road to South Carolina. I literally have like a three hour drive ahead of me. Not excited. I made it. It took me like a little over three hours, but I made it. We're here. We're at the radio room in Greenville, South Carolina. Let's go in and see uh, Jay Book. And actually, Oscar came too. Let's go in. I'm 
In clarification, he didn't tell you guys, he told his guys. So on a side question, are the JBLs better than your QSCs? They are definitely loud. All right, that's all I needed. That's all you need. JBL PRX 818 XLFs louder than QSC KW 181s. I have to give credit for credit. They are definitely loud. See, they're actually not louder, they get lower. Okay. That's the kicker. Okay, because my QSCs do not make my ears ring. The, these, well, that's why they put extra low frequency in the name. They get lower than what a QSC gets. QSCs are really good about getting down to like maybe 60, 70 hertz, but below that they really struggle, yep. in my opinion. Yep. Um, these XLX from uh, JBL and same thing with the VRXs, they can get down into the 40s and 30s pretty good and uh, have good volume with it, so that's why I like them more. Side note, EV is also really good at getting down to low frequencies. Just because I got here late, uh, let's uh, let's go over what Jay Book uses. Real quick, I got the Pineman DDJ SX2. SX2. Two. You should get a three. Uh, I don't know, I think if I get anything else, it'll move up to the SZ. All right, they're, they're literally the same thing, and a used SE actually costs the same as what a, SX, a new SX3 does, so. Yeah, I think I'm ready for the big call. Odyssey case? Odyssey, no, no, this is a Pro X case. Pro X case? Got, Got the ADJ Airstream DMX bridge. I might have just ordered one of those. <laughs> Maybe. I've got the... You'll see eventually. Audio Technica wireless mic. What what are Audio Technica? Uh, it's the digital one, the Wi-Fi yeah. based one. Yes, it is the digital. One. Pioneer. Fifteen hundred. Yeah, there you go. Audio wise, Yamaha DXP 15s and JBL Purex uh, 818 XLFs. The speakers are actually the house system, which runs off of back here on the wonderful Behringer X32 rack, and uh, they're running. Q light control. Not really sure what that is. They got a bunch of Chave, it looks like Chave pars up and around, and back and forth. Um, and then Mr. J Book brought this wonderful T bar. These are the Mega Tripar Pluses. Uh, he's got two of those set up and in a pocket spots. And this one somehow glitched out and is not working right now. Uh, anybody at ADJ reach out to J Book and get it fixed. Alrighty guys, to save you the misery of watching my three hour trip home, um, I'm gonna end the video right here. Really? Okay, I, I watched the edit. So you guys haven't seen the video yet, um, but the video that we did together in Greensboro. Yeah. You're like not even in it. <laughs> what? Like literally the only footage I have of you is walking up the stairs going, oh my God, don't get me on foot. Oh my God. And then the next footage is just like him randomly at the gig, like loud music and nothing. And then you know the after footage. You know what's funny though? Is when I did my edit, he was all over the edit. I got shots of him. I got overhead shots. I got all but kind of shots. Shots you didn't normally get. We didn't have conversations, what I'm saying. We did. We like did. the whole time that we spent the whole day together, none of it got filmed. Which is normally how it goes though. When Bar came, we did the same thing. Yeah. We just kind of went to work, guys. Well, a lot of stuff we talk about, we can't talk about. This is true. It, this is true. This guy put me up on a lot of game, man. This is true. Listen to him. He's a genius. So if you want a coaching session, it's a thousand dollars. Oh my God. <laughs> First, <laughs> blue blue. Cut. But anyways, guys, that's all for this collab gig vlog behind the scene of Jay Book in a sorority party crazy madness thing. If you like this video, be sure to like this video. Subscribe to Jay Book. His link is in the description down below as well as somewhere up in this vicinity. Probably gotta ring the notification. See, I don't even say that. Oh, he doesn't even say it. I don't say it. I don't say hey, it. Ring. ring the bell anyway. Ring his bell. Yeah, ring the bell because I never tell you to ring the bell, but <laughs> you guys that are notification squad, I see you in the comments. I know where you're at. But anyways, guys, my name is DJ Rick Webb. Keep them records spinning and I will see you guys next time. Peace. Hey.